Hey, what's up, guys? I don't know, I haven't made a video in a while, but, you know, I don't know, I was just lazy, to be honest. But, right now, so a few weeks ago, like, maybe two weeks ago, a week and a half ago, I don't know how long ago exactly, I made a predictions, and of what the rewards for a bitch were going to be, and this was, like... These rewards, I'm gonna be honest, are pretty shit. I'm not gonna lie. They're still the best in game, but like, if you look at the rewards on the list for like best exploration and completion, like in like a year or two, these rewards are gonna be like pretty, like nothing. Like, just nothing. So, for my completion, my guess we're gonna have just a big chunk of five star shards. Not even close. Uh, we had none. I was, I guess, 25,000 six star shards. We got 20,000, so pretty much the same thing. I guess 12 to a 2 alpha, they're giving us 7. I didn't think of saying any 2 5 basic. Um, I think I might have, but I forgot to add it. But we have 3 2 5 basic, which was eh, decent. 6 star working gem crystal, I got that right. But then this one was just so it made it depressing. I thought it was going to be like labyrinth. We get 1 of every class of tier 5 CC. We get 1 random tier 5 CC crystal. That is like. You could literally. Pull a mystic. Do you know how tragic that would be? Like, oh my god, I don't want to think about that. So, exploration, I thought we were going to get one random unique character, like um, how we got the Ultron classic. Uh, we just don't get anything, so that's cool. Um, I put 50 to 60,000 six star shards. We got 45,000 six star shards, so pretty much the same thing, yeah. I guess, okay, and this is where it just goes really bad. Like, I thought exploration. Would give you the ability to rank four like one six star if you do the entire hundred percent you can get one character six so i guess four two three alpha we don't see any we got four two or two alpha which is pretty nothing six star generic i guessed which is you know i mean i thought i knew i feel it would be that it's kind of obvious i put a hundred six star six turn crystals they put 50. so if that averages out that's like less than 10 for each class so i don't know how useful it actually is and then i said two of every class tier five cc kind of like labyrinth so like Six star rank three is even more available. Nah, dude, you're getting for exploration the entire thing. You're getting two random tier five CCs. What if, okay, for completion you get a mystic, then for exploration you get like a second mystic or a third even? Like, what do you even do at that point? Like, it's so tragic. Like, there's too much luck involved. Like, yeah, it's just not good. These rewards are just not. I thought it was gonna be so much better. Like. And later, like a year from now, like 2021 in January, tier 5 CC is probably going to be a lot more accessible. And it probably won't be even that good for the difficulty because this is going to be stupidly difficult. Um, and then finally, I thought they're going to be 3 tier 6 basics. So, like, once again, with the tier from 3 alpha, like, if you do the whole thing, you can get 1 rank 4 6 star. Because um, to rank 4 or 6 star, you need 4 or 3 tier 2 alpha or tier 3 alpha, something like that. 3 or. Four, and then you need three tier six basic. So I thought after doing everything a hundred percent, you can at least get one. Nah, you get like nothing. It's just, it's like disappointing, honestly. Like the rewards, which is, I think lag as he said in his video too. Like, in one year from now, these rewards are gonna be like good, but like not like the amount of effort invested like into it to be. These rewards won't last. They won't stand the test of time after like a year or two at all. Unless Kabam goes really stingy and just be like, I'm not getting other ways to get tier 5 CC. But I don't think it's going to happen. I think by the end of 2021, tier 5 CC is going to be a lot more accessible. I honestly think, and this is going to be weird to think about, I feel like Act 6 rewards might be better than Abyss of Legends rewards. Which is kind of weird to think about because if you look at exploration once or abyss, you get like what's the best thing in here? Two random tier five CC and the six star generic. But doing exploration, I think you're gonna get a six star generic from Act Six also, and there's a good chance you're gonna get some tier five CC also. So it's like I don't. I see. I think we're gonna get one random tier five CC catalyst like what you do in um for the completion awards or. Like, I don't know, like, the, the difficulty just seems like, mm, I don't know, I feel like Act 6, 100%, we should look act after to see, it might be better than Abyss, which is kind of sad to say out loud, but yeah, I mean, 
if you see any tier 3 alpha or tier 6 basic and next 6 that already puts it above abyss so i mean we'll see what they do but i hope you guys enjoyed this video get a like comment subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next one peace